Greetings YouTube, this is BJ Black and this is part 4 of my Let's Play of Super Meat Boy. Today I'm going to do Chapter 5 Rapture. So this is a heaven to do with the previous chapter's hell of some form. Pretty crappy heaven. Oh ha. Well that didn't take long. So there's 20 bandages in each chapter, and there's 20 levels in each chapter, so obviously that means there's one bandage per chapter. No, one bandage per level. Hmm. Well, isn't that nice? Okay. Oh. Not quite. Hmm. Ba ba Oh ha, there we go. Oh, this isn't going to be a pain in the ass at all. Nope. Okay. Too late. Yeah, I knew just after I jumped that it was too late. Hmm. Ah. Almost there. So there was a warp zone up there, but it was a purple warp zone, so I don't care about it. <clears throat> I know a little bit about warp zones that I looked up in my hours. The purple ones have a couple of bandages in them. Oh, there wasn't a bandage in this level, even though there should be. Yeah. The purple ones have a couple bandages each, and the red ones get characters. A long time ago, I watched a playthrough of this game. Oh, that isn't something that instantly kills me. I'm used to everything doing that, really. Anyway, I watched a playthrough of this game a long time ago. And the player did the I want to be the guy. Or was doing the levels that unlocked I want the the kid from I want to be the guy but he quit and I was really disappointed so if I can find I'm still alive you've got to be kidding me um gonna happen I guess it will Anyway, the Let's Play I watched a long time ago had the I want to be the guy warp zone, but the guy quit out of it, which I was really disappointed in as an old fan of I want to be the guy. I, I beat that game, actually. Something I'm proud of is I beat I want to be the guy. Repulsors. Kind of annoying. 
Hey, a bandage. Are those rats on the floor? Oh, whatever. Hmm. Okay, I'm going to jump here, slide up there, and get the bandage girl. Repulsors. Okay, I need this repulsor to shoot me up into that hole. But not too far. Thanks a bunch. Or maybe if I time it just right, I don't need to worry about that. Uh... Come on! <laughs> oh, I thought I got this down. Whoops. All right, just need a bit of timing. Um, hmm. Now what? I fall to my death, of course. All right. Repulsors will not only repel you up, they'll, they'll also repel you down. Which will probably come in handy at some point, but right now it just kills me. Like so. All right. I'm, I know I'm dead, but... Uh, may as well bloody up the whole wall. Get up to... Floating on those things is harder than it looks. Nah. Haha. <laughs> I bandaged girl. Ready to get kidnapped again? Alright. Are those buttons? What horrible thing will they do to me? Oh, great. No coming back? That looks like it would have a secret in it. Hey, a bandage. I could totally get that bandage, but I... Hmm. You know, up top it looks like there might be a secret as well. I'm surprised I didn't kill myself. You know, these blind jumps into nowhere. Did I do that on my first try? How oh, nice. That third switch open up, I wonder. If I, you know, get far enough to not die. It, I'll probably be able to tell. Yeah. Alright, here we go. What? <sighs> Too tall. Okay. It's right there in front of Bandage Girl. So slippery. You know, I really don't think I'm the ideal candidate for a blind let's play. I don't scream when I die or anything. I mean, especially when I have an audience. I suppose I've been known to swear on occasion. 
but typically only when I'm by myself. I mean, it would be uncivilized to swear in front of you people. Oh, great. Come on, be opening back here. Would it be that hard? Alright, the key's up there. The big key's up there. Is it just instant death down there? Oh, well, who knows. Here's a key. Ah. Nope, it's instant death. How about down here? No. I guess it's safe on this run. If you want to, you know, hazard a couple of saw blades. Oops. Easy way. Ha. Huh. You can't make me go down the suicidal dash shaft if I don't want to. Well, maybe you can't. Ah, oh, jeez. I should have avoided that easy. And that was me mostly suiciding because I didn't care. Uh, Alright, no more suicides. Well, unless the game's unwinnable. As it probably will be when I miss this. Oh, come on. Hey, a warp zone. But it's purple, I don't care. Um... Oh, crap. Now that I can't open those blocks, I need to do this. Well, at least I don't have to go down the suicide death shaft. I just have to go up it when the time comes. Uh. <clears throat> but this is easy. I can do this. Now that all the saw blades in the level are properly bloodied up, maybe we can get to actually beating the level. Whoops. Whoops, that was close. Close. Didn't think I would make it. All right, level complete. Um, yeah, moving platforms, everybody's favorite. Death traps abound. Hmm. This should be easy. Just find the safe spots and you'll be fine. Provided there are safe spots. Two on the left, one in the center. But be careful. Uh, in the left. Left, left, center with a jump. Yeah. Hmm. Maybe if I don't jump. It's pattern recognition. I figure there's a pattern, so I do a patterny thing. Yeah. Okay, concentrate instead of talking. I'm gonna keep talking actually, but I should be concentrating. 
Ha. Um. That's not horrible at all. And why were they already bloody? I hadn't died on them yet. Yar. Alright. That's it? I figured it, if I didn't get off right away, it would go back up, forcing me to do the whole thing backwards. Ah, another level where you start right next to Bandage Girl. Oh, what? Well, isn't that nice? But what did I get in over here? Okay. Stop it. Um, suicide me poor person. Hey! That was a bandage sound. There was a bandage up there. I found a bandage and I wasn't even trying to. <clears throat> Get away from you, you horrible rejects. Ugh. Oh wait, now I don't have the bandage anymore. Hey, I can see the bandage in my eight open pixels over there. Uh... Come on, be more... Have more tunnels up here where I don't have to deal with the exploding death people. And what are these guys' problems? I mean, this is different from pretty much everything I've fought up to now. Ah. Meepo, you stick to shit too much. Oh crap. <clears throat> Alright, exploding suicide bastards. Wait, did I hit a switch that opened that that let that guy out? I should try to not hit that switch. Ugh. I heard a switch sound, so it may have been a switch. Or it may have been just some horrible thing then. Oh, I see it! And it's not in a place I can avoid, either. Yeah. These things are horrible. Yeah. You don't want to be over them. Well, you don't want to be on them, either, or... Get her! They don't accelerate as fast as Meat Boy, which is good because the whole thing about Meat Boy is he's so damn fast. Yeah. <laughs> Bastards. Um. I want them to be not close to me when I'm grabbing the key, because that totally sucks. Now, how to get them out of there without them killing me? Here we are. Don't feel like dealing with you bastards. Ah, you suck. Metalhead? Oh, uh, I got enough. I got enough um, bandages to unlock a guy, I guess. <clears throat> this is horrible. Hey, how nice. <clears throat> I can kill them. Well, they can kill me too. 
the crap. Alright. That I, of course. I can't just do a standard wall jump. I'll die. <clears throat> Thank God for me boy being so damn fast. Um <laughs> Now, I'm going to kill you off, because I like killing you off. Um... Alright. Uh, girl! I'm here to save you! <coughs> of course. Now that we're... Now that we have these guys, we have to have them in every level. Okay. Not very smart, though. Okay. Great. Hunter? Right. I wasn't paying attention and the thing killed me. Obviously. Is that more salt? N n wait. Those are giant white maggots, aren't they? Of course they kill me. Uh, nope. Hmm, that's not gonna work. Haha, <laughs> die. Yep. That's how I do it. Uh. <clears throat> there was probably an easier way. I think I know what the easier way is. Is it going to spit out bastards every time? And no. Uh, just the ones. Ah. Uh. You are a great game, Super Meat Boy. Uh. <laughs> hmm. Okay. It looks like I'll be getting up there later. Go. Alright, timing is important. Okay, so I can get up here, but there's nothing here right now. Okay. Jump on the platform, jump between saw blades, and then where I land, I can only guess. <coughs> Ah. Tons of maggots. Ah. <clears throat> okay. Okay. Jump a little bit earlier. <clears throat> Jump a little bit later. Haha, <laughs> die, sucker. 
Yeah, <clears throat> I deserve that. What? I saw a bandage on there. Is that even possible? Yeah, I guess it is. I'm not gonna try it now, though. Uh. <clears throat> right there, touching her. Come on. Great A plus. Uh, thanks, meat ninja guy. There's a couple of maggots moving around down there, like normal movement. <coughs> oh, we've done this before in Mega Man games. And um, other games. Okay. Where are the other people? The musical depths of me. Super Meatball. Nope. Ah, stop that. <clears throat> I can do this. I can do this. This is easy. Okay. Uh, remember where the run button is. You basically always have to have the run button pressed down in this game. Even if I don't, I should. I usually do, because I'm impatient. Everybody knows. I think I'm going to need an extra jump for height there, if I have time. <clears throat> okay, death. Got impatient. Whatever. Okay, now that I have it figured out, I can't seem to do it anymore. Okay, these are just a little bit out of time with each other. You'll see one will pop in and be completely there before the others are gone. where well, the others will come in after the first set is completely done. You can see right here, all three were visible for a moment, and you can see right here, they're all invisible for a moment. Yeah, that's not helping me. Ah, I have figured it out. I feel smart now. Oh, look at me die. Why do I have to get the feeling something horrible is going to happen here? Jump to my death! Hell, that sounds good to me. Eventually I'll land on something. Alright, right here. Mm, no, I left. Let the run button off. What kind of crazy ass bastard am I? Eh, well, I can do it the easy way, I guess. Brr. 
Um, you know speedrunners just do this. Num, 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 num. Yeah. I can't believe that worked. Okay, come over here, bastard. Oh, great. What? I got a key. Now I have to go back and find another key, right? This is just great. Wait, was that there to begin with? Good. No. No, it wasn't. No, come on. There, I got it. And I died. I shouldn't have jumped there. Splat! Free fall. Alright, horrible thing. Go back to sleep because I'm too far away. That should open up the gate that will allow me to continue in the level. Haha. <laughs> Burrerum. Okay. Vanish girl, here I am. <coughs> this shaking obviously means I'm going to die. I don't know. And of course little white maggots that I have to deal with. Lest I die. Uh, Precision under fire. I love doing this. All right, a little later. Do I have to wait until the maggots are practically on top of me so I don't fall on that thing? I think I do. But I keep trying anyway, because I'm a sucker for punishment. And now it's pure muscle memory. Alright, I got a little further. Maybe I can get in ahead of the thing. <clears throat> Okay, I had a momentary bit of safety there. <laughs> A button! A button jumps! Precision controls. Uh. Okay, regular jump the first one, speed jump the second. Okay, what happens if the maggot stream comes out that way? What's it look like? Do they fall off a cliff? Do they just automatically kill me or something? My intuition tells me there's something down here. My intuition's right. But why did I go down there? Does that mean there's something over here? Oh yeah, yeah, there's something over here. 
Uh, let me guess, those repulsors mean I can't possibly get over there. <clears throat> well... Alright. Come on! You know, I'm betting if you have split-second timing, you could do that. Now what? Oh, great. One of those eater things. <clears throat> Leave me alone. You sack of whatever you are. Uh -huh. I'm dead. <clears throat> All right. Now getting up there. So I hit the repulsor, avoid the death thing. Whoops. Why did I think I had a double jump? No. Crap. Jump for it! Oh, it has an animation if it kills me. That's uh, great, I guess. <clears throat> Alright. And the eater bastard isn't. Another eater bastard. Alright. Left you behind. Sucker. I bet that bandage isn't all that hard to get. Mm. Well, this is pretty easy. I say immediately before I get my. <coughs> Oh my god, why did I do that? Oh, these again. Uh... Aren't those dissolving blocks? I guess. Or something? They were hard to dissolve compared to other blocks I've dissolved before. So, oh, I get it. I need to blow it up with a rocket. Or rather, I need to get a rocket to blow it up. <laughs> oh, perfect timing. Alright. Pro tip, don't do that. Ah, that's how it goes. Okay. Here I go. Ha! Ah, suckers! All your death traps mean nothing to me. In fact, I use your death traps in order to not die. Ha! Ah. Oh, this is going to be fun. Something tells me that the 
key blocks are going to start unlocking over where I'm standing here and force me to survive in the center until it gets around until it finally gets around to bandage girl. These aren't easy to balance on, you know that? Whoops. Ah, oh, come on. Oh, great. Just about got the bandage. What more could anyone want? No, oh, please don't kill me. Oh, who am I kidding? They're going to kill me probably multiple times. Uh, I should pay more attention instead of talking. Okay, death from below. <clears throat> okay, this is... Easy, easy, yes. That would be the second part of my sentence. Uh, hmm. I got really close to the center of that thing. Out of sheer desperation, I'm sure. <laughs> Too late. Oh, so many juicy deaths. <laughs> okay, okay. Mm. <clears throat> okay, I'm safe as long as I don't die. Whoops. Whoa. This could be dangerous. Haha, <laughs> I dodged you. <clears throat> Obviously dodging is not as perfect as it could be. Seeing as I often do not dodge and kill me. Oh, come on, yeah! Great A plus. Can't ask any more than that. Uh sublate shooter. Uh nothing to say about that. Gah. That's cheap. But how do I open the other ones? And it's time. Uh oh, it's one of the time blocks you have to press a button for. And the button is up here. I'm dead. Yeah. I jumped into a dead end with a couple of rockets coming after me. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. <sighs> okay, here we go again. Ha! Suckers! Uh, now I've got something easy. This looks easy. This, what? Okay. This can be done. Ha! Not so bad. It's just that first double rocket room that killed me three or four times. Oh, great. Face eaters. Yep. Ah, 
I have to do that while dodging face eaters. Guess what? I'm gonna scroll you guys off the screen where I think you guys forget I exist or something. Booyah, you are not as fast as me, boy. Okay. Time to block buggers. Everybody loves these. And more rockets. Okay. There's Bandage Girl. And underneath them are a bunch of explode bastards. And a bandage. You know what? You guys can keep the bandage. Oh! This is the end of the uh, Rapture. That's what this chapter is called. And this is called Larry's Lament. Whatever that means. Obviously something I need to kill. Uh, many things I need to kill. Wait a minute, Meat Boy is completely defenseless. Uh, so... My intuition tells me I lure them onto. Yep. How high do those things go? High enough that if I stand on them, I'm safe? I bet what happens is exactly the opposite. If I stand on them, I die horribly. Die, die, die. Damn it. Okay. <laughs> explosions! Everybody loves explosions. Except for me, on account of they kill me. Okay. Jump up the same wall as it goes up. Haha, <laughs> sucker! Wait. Ah, damn. I was looking at him instead of, you know, me. And it meant I died. Ow. Projectiles. No. Sometimes it does the crawler at me, and sometimes it doesn't, huh? Whoops. There seems to be a little bit of random energy to this. Oh, come on, they come lower than that. Oh, this side does. Anyway. Oops. All right.
Okay. Don't do what I need to do. See if I care. Get away from me. Uh, you don't even make enough distance. Uh, now they're on the left side. If they jump. Yeah, this conveyor goes up to one space from the bottom, but this one stops at two spaces below ground level. Uh, I just about had one. Why is it that they only pop up when I, I'm, you know, killing myself? Here goes the uh, lag. Okay, obviously something went wrong there. I ran out of hard drive space in the middle of the boss battle. I'm not really sure how long it took me to kill the boss after my hard drive crapped out. You know, you figure if you have 20% of your hard drive left that you can handle this kind of thing, but no. 100 megabyte hard drive, I got almost 100 megs left. 500 megabyte hard drive, I have almost 100 megabytes left, and I have to do this anyway. Somehow or another, you can lure them into jumping and killing themselves. I'm not exactly sure how, but I figured it. But after doing this enough times, you eventually get the hang of it. Oh, give me a break. You horrible, horrible. Excuse this for uh, giant crumb worm things. Okay, so you're pretty good excuse for giant grub worms. You're still horrible. Uh, I really don't know what makes them jump sometimes, but not other times. But if you stick with it, eventually they'll kill themselves. Ugh. Projectiles. I hate projectiles. Why don't I get projectiles? I would like them then. You've actually got a pretty good safe spot from the crawlers over on the right side. Yeah, naturally they kill me when I get too close. This is the normal thing. Yeah, sometimes it's easy and sometimes it isn't. This should be good. And Meat Boy gets smacked again. Oh, nope, it's not a straight smack down. We actually get a cliffhanger here. So bam. Off screen I went in. Whoops. I'm going to talk about this a little while. A little bit more. Don't go ahead on me. Okay. The rapture. I went ahead and unlocked a couple of warp zones. And this one is one I'm going to be doing. If I complete it, I'll do it on screen, but if I don't, I probably won't. Well, hell, I'll complete it eventually. It's I want to be the guy. And I'm obliged by honor to complete it because I beat the, that game too. You know, Meat Boy could jump that. He's pretty fast. That's the story of I Want to Be the Guy. 
spoil that in this. If you haven't played, I want to be the guy. That's about what you're missing. And this horrible series of events this is something you get to do if you want to try and beat this. You have no idea how long I tried this. This is almost as far as I've gotten. I got to that next open spot and I've always died getting there. There you go. So, I will be practicing this a lot before I try and show it on screen, so until next time, YouTube.